Yes, was pleased. Well, I would like guys. to meet you again. Is that a good thing? Of course. Well, Although I'm starting guys. to think oh. that Diaz was responsible for our unfortunate loss. What makes you say that? One and does not wave accusations at a man like Diaz. I'm never thinking out loud. No matter. I have a proposal that you can call I don't have time to run more errands, Cortez. I would have thought a man with such dangerous dates would be hungry for opportunities. Please, Tommy, at least hear me out. Go on. I have a buyer for a piece of military hardware that is being taken through town. Pick it up for yeah. me. And once you get it, I want you to call me immediately. Then... Call you immediately. Okay, anyway, we think I'll pick up some military hardware. As you see, I still got my um, Cuban outfit on. Still rocking the cube. Still rocking the cube. Still rocking the cube. Still rocking the cube. Rocking cube. All right. Anyway, let's get right into it. Now, sir, yes, sir. People think this is a hard mission in retrospect. They think the mission consists of you just. People think this mission consists of you kind of shoot the whole convoy. It consists of you trying to shoot the con the whole convoy up just to kill it. No, it's not. It's just as easy as you try to think it is. I'm gonna show you guys. I'm gonna show you guys. Watch this. Just wait right here. Just go ahead, wait right here because they do. What the hell? You still running? <laughs> just wait right here because they they still gotta go through there. So just wait right there. And I don't got the Kroger. How did I find that ammo for the Kroger? It don't even matter. I hate using that gun anyways. Anyways, I hope you guys are having a good day. Rather you watching it live on stream. Or if you're watching it via upload on YouTube, either way it goes, I do appreciate you guys for taking the time to check the video out. And yeah, I hope you guys, I hope you guys had an amazing day so far. Or depending on the time of time y'all watching the video uploaded on YouTube, I hope your day's going good so far. And yeah. So yeah, we're definitely waiting right now. Um. Oh, there it is. Go get some donuts, soldier. Sir, yes, sir. Convoy, halt. I need that. Civilian, move away from the tank. Civilian, stop it. position. Just that. Just that. I find it so funny how all of a sudden once you complete a mission with the cops involved, they just stop chasing you like Oh, okay, he's a good guy. As the title of the video do suggest. Shit's gonna get real. As you guys can see. Waiting for a call. Yep. Oh. Okay. Anyways, I know exactly where you gotta go. So basically, you're gonna head to the mouth of the Because shit is gonna be real. Oh, he, he flew high in the air, so he definitely flew high. Anyways, in this video, we're, we're actually gonna. And start our own criminal as we start striking the field, starting our own criminal empire. That's really the best part of the match. Let's head over to the 
out of the club because, well, that's when we should get our call at. And there right, it is. Bill, going up? It's Paul. I might have a little result for you, but I need to speak to you in person. I'm enjoying a little arm and arm at the Club Malibu. I reckon you're going to owe me a favor or two out of this sunshine. I'll see you later. Yep. Death Row. All right, Mush. I'm going to save your Vera, mate. Due to copyright, I got to skip this cutscene. But I'm going to just explain it. Basically, Lance called his dumbass. Lance dumbass called his son trying to go after the ass. On his own. And ruined the whole plan. And that was a stupid decision by Lance. Because not only did you blow your chances of doing it silently, who the chances are at the See, Lance is always a dummy. I definitely dislike him. But right now, what we're doing is we got to just save him. Unfortunately. It was up to me, I would have died. And as you guys can notice from the difference between the Infinite Edition and like the regular PS2 and also the PS4, is that. For one, that's not the point. Anyways, Lance helps degenerate slow. Lance helps degenerate. Lance help go down slow. Ah, my balls double. Yeah. Oh, you it's okay to grab the money too. Okay. Just like that. I mean, I just. I hate using a Kroger actually. No. It has too much. Just really took over my all my health, huh? Um, I was keep on looking around for enemies. They do spawn out of nowhere. See, see no. Target the guy. Okay, it's weird, cause they used to be. Um, no. All this money. How much Diaz is paying, y'all? I need the money. There goes my careful planning blown to shit. Thanks to you. You screwed up real Dumbass. good, Lance. He killed my brother. What do you expect me to do, mow his lawns? We're gonna have to take out that prick Diaz before he takes us out. You okay to use a gun? Sure. I guess. Nice to see you too. Let's get out of here. Fucking idiot, bro. Okay, here's the part that everybody do hate. When you escape, even the slightest bump. Lance, come on. Anyways, the slightest bump could really set Lance off. So what we're gonna do is just yeah, take your time with it. Just drive as good as you can. Obviously, we're driving a fucking Sentinel, so that ain't gonna help us outrun these cars. So yeah, at the you heard Lance right now. It is gonna be time to kill the final. That loud mouth prick can go down. All right, so far so good. They're way behind us. So at that point, you need it. But yeah, this 
Be careful with crash. No crash. No crash. Get patched up and meet me on the bridge to Star Island, okay? Okay, I got you. I find it, I do find it funny how he just walked in the hospital. Diaz mission. We're finally taking out Diaz, guys. Okay. Body armor location number four. Tommy, Tomas, it's Cortez. Look, the French are giving me all kinds of trouble, amigo. Them hypocrites. They spend a hundred years stealing from poor countries, and they call me a thief, huh? I'm going to need your help as soon as possible, amigo. So please hurry. I tell me I need you, alright? Oh, yeah, I'm gonna call for, um, for, for number this. But that's not the, the next week. We'll start off his mission in the next video as well as the second assassination mission. The assassination missions are not a part of the main story. At all. out. Yep, it's time to take out this loudmouth prick. Finally. I got us some cannons in the trunk. Holy shit, where'd you get all this stuff? Been saving for a rainy day. <laughs> you like? Yes, the M16. Yeah, I yes. like. Now, I like this gun way better than the Kruger. Yeah, Diaz, we're coming for you, ho. A little reminiscence of Scarface. That gun ain't gonna do shit, dude. You're dead. This place is gonna be crawling with assholes. Be careful. Don't worry, Tommy. I'll cover you. I gotta save the ammo. Don't even worry about the police. This obviously. way, Lance, slow down, dude. Slow down, Lance. Okay. Do shit. Diaz must be inside. He gotta be. Look at the arm. Look how much detail they did the armory in this game. Oh. Your arms and then your legs. Shut up. Okay. All right. What do you think, you dickhead? Hey, Tommy, can my room have a view of the bay? No, nigga. <laughs> Eliminate them. <laughs> Fuck. Diaz! I've come to take I've over come your to take business. Over your Tommy, business. you betrayed me, you one? idiot. I'm gonna kill you real quick. <laughs> you murdering bastard. <laughs> Fat ass running. <laughs> Bitch. He's dead. 
You stupid pricks! My beautiful house! Look what you done to it! This is for my brother! Uh, I trusted you, Tommy! All right. <laughs> I would have had I would have you made! Say goodnight, Mr. Diaz! Diaz Mansion is now yours. This is definitely my favorite part of the game. Okay, obviously we're gonna just go ahead and save it. Rob out. Before we do this mission, before we do the next mission, let me go over you, you guys on what the mansion is good for. Look at that, you got health right there. Oh shit, Call me son, this? I've got a surprise for you. I'm down at recording studios with some major artists. Why don't you pass a visit? You know it makes sense, don't ya? See you later. I wish you could just fucking hang up. So yeah, we got a shitload of mission plot lines open. Obviously. Give me Look a at break. this. The armory. You automatically get a body armor, a free shotgun, and some more um what hard assault work rifle we got? ammo. So you definitely cannot go wrong with that either way. Which is what I like. Who the fuck Sonny, is this? Remember me? Hello, Sonny. That's right, Sonny. We're all friends. I wouldn't do you that. You never write me, you never call. Don't you want to be friends no more? I've been busy trying to sort no. things out. You didn't give me a lot of support down here, Sonny. Oh, my fault, is it? Well, I've heard you've been busy, all right. Busy killing drug barons. Busy taking over. Don't forget about us, Tommy. Because I can assure you, I ain't forgotten about you. Man, fuck you, Sonny. You left me. You left me rot, rot in, in, oh, in prison. We gotta decorate this place. We gotta make it look older. I can't stand this look. Ugh. Tommy, what do you say? What do you say we put a bar in? You're my lawyer, Rosenberg, not my interior decorator. Got it? Exactly. Listen to me. The time to take over this town is now. It's all out there waiting for us. We need to start seizing territory and let Vice City know we're the new players so in town. You know what I'm saying? What you need is a legitimate right front, here. Tommy. Real estate. It's never done me no harm. We need to start using some muscle. Well, we can kiss all that hard work goodbye. Local business know Diaz is dead, and they're refusing to pay protection. Oh, we could try bribery. Bribery? Screw bribery. bribery. Screw I'll show you bribery. how to make them scared. I'll be back here in five minutes. So you got a timer to get to the mall. This mission is not as bad as people think it is, but um, it's easy, it's actually an easy mission. Let's be honest. Oh my god! Look, this, I'm gonna just keep it going, guys. Uh, this mission is just gonna be short and easy. At least in the Definitive Edition. In the Definitive Edition, um, this shit's gonna be easy as hell. That's great. Stop shooting me. Okay. And that's it, actually. 
Shakedown, they, they definitely shortened the mission Shakedown in this game. At first I did thought it was a glitch, but it turns out it wasn't. They did actually shorten it. See, look, this is what I'm saying. This mall, I don't remember the mall having this much detail, to be honest. I ain't going nowhere with you, Who Hi, is this? Sir. Just thought I'd ring you up and give you some advice. Hey, Avery, what's eating you? There's a lot of opportunity in this town if you own the right real estate. You catch my drift? I reckon so. All I'm saying is to keep your eyes open, and you might find the perfect business opportunity. I'll catch you later. Later, Avery. All right. Anyways, now back to the mansion. So yeah, basically what I was saying was DS ran a protection racket. So that's what um, Tommy took over from him. Um, but yeah. But um, I also after this, you know, after the mission shakedown, that's when you're able to start buying your property and all that. You know, to start building your criminal empire. And like, I will explain to you guys like what, because each business in this game, as a, when you first play, like as someone who don't understand, you wouldn't, like I said, you wouldn't understand it. Obviously, but like. As as you get older and you play this game more, you understand more and more what the game is, is really about. So yeah, with that being said, oh shit. Okay. Who is that shooting, bro? What is going on? Anyway, let's go to the armory and see if, they, if we did get a restock. Yep. No, no, no assault rifle ammo. I was praying on that though, because I could really use that. All right, pay attention to this cutscene, guys, because it's going to be a phone call that's going to come in handy with it later on, like shortly after this mission. What's the problem? Some bars refusing to pay. They reckon they're protected by a local gang of thugs. But don't worry, Tommy. I can handle it. You call this handling it? You two, off your asses. Let's go. So Lance gets mad that he's being yelled at, but Tommy is not wrong because you're supposed to be a capital regime. And you're just sitting there while shit, while they just attack. Oh, shoot. Dude, can you bring your ass on? So your land's supposed to be a capital regime. But he didn't do shit at all. And I don't understand what he's mad about. Because he didn't do nothing for one. So therefore he got no reason to commit. It's backwards, honestly, if you ask me. When it rains, it's so hard to control these cars, especially the center. Just like that. Yo, check it out. Your protection I'm needs a, a little more protection. Ah, oh, hell, not again. 
I don't need this crap. These idiots operate out of DBP security around the block. You guys just sort it out amongst yourselves. I'll be seeing you later. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Pay that shit. All right, you guys, get in the car. So basically what they're doing is they're he's basically trying to convince them that they need protection. There's a whole bunch of things right here. I ran, I ran over in front of the cop too. Anyways, Lance as a cavalry regime. Lance as a cavalry regime would be sucks. Because let's say something happened to Tommy. Lance is second in command. Against. Bro! Seriously, y'all doing this shit on purpose. Anyways, Lance is second to um in charge. And then you sit there and let stuff like this happen. No, of course they're not going to take you seriously. And then you got the nerve to get mad because he's embarrassing you. It's called setting an example and being a good and being a good leader. Learn something. The phone call coming down. Tommy, we got to talk about stuff. What's the problem, Lance? See? It's you, my friend. I feel you're not giving me a fair slice. And more than that. You've been embarrassing me in front of the boys. I can't have that. Lance, it ain't like that. You've been making mistakes. Tommy, I'm not your message boy. I'm not your running boy. Lance, don't screw up and we won't have any problems. I screw up, you can lay into me anytime. Tommy, Fair I've point. done everything for you. You treat me like a fool. Don't do that. Lance, I won't rip you off or stab you in the back, okay? Just take it easy. This is tough enough without you getting all emotional on me. Trust me. Do you hear me? Do you hear me? I hear you, Tommy. But I can't take this much more. Lance, don't be like this. Now I'm warning you. Do you hear me? Just relax. Take a few days off. Okay? I'll talk to you. So yeah. What other boss... What other gang 
What other leader would tell their people Copland? You oh, moron! God. What were you thinking? Do you realize what this means? We could all be so- I don't know, the timer must have got screwed. That place was wired to go up like a firework factory. And somebody tipped off the cops, but everything What's the problem, apart. fellas? Mike was supposed to torch some place in the mall, but he screwed the fuses, and now yeah, the cops are crawling all over it. We gotta get our stuff and get out of here. Relax, both of you. Let me think for a second. Tommy Versetti just doesn't cut and run. The cops are gonna be going so over that building with a fine-tooth comb, explain. right? But that takes no time. No other mob boss would We gotta go in you and act, torch that place ourselves. Act, yeah, but no one but a cop could get within a mile like of that place. That to talk so to we go boss, as cops. We gotta get uniforms and we're gonna need a, a squad in car. A, in a hurry. Well, thanks to you, Tommy Mike. I'm sorry. Hand, he <laughs> actually gave Lance the permission. All we gotta do is lure the cops in with the finger. Put him in a locker. That's something you don't often see out of a boss. Good plan. Let's go. All right. You know? Okay, Lance, let's get the cops' attention. Oh yeah, that's definitely something right there, man. Lance, he, uh, I don't know what to say about him. He's a piece of shit. I hope they fix all the issues that this mission has. So people would say this is one of the hardest missions in the game. But now that I'm replaying it, it's not that bad. And I'm saying that now because of the new Descender Edition, like probably updated gameplay. No, actually not. Because I did actually go back and replay it on the original version as well. And it's really not that hard as long as you gotta you got you follow the strategies. Oh yeah, that's So right now we gotta get the cops' attention. Now that got them really irritated. Okay. Bring him in here, Lance. Come on! I really think there must be some mistake. Jesus Christ! This is the this is this Time part I don't get. like. Ooh, fits perfectly. Bit tight around crotch though. Oh yeah, yeah, mine too, mine too. What the fuck? He just disappears. Top outfit, ha. <laughs> Of course, it's gonna be a cop car right here. What the fuck? Why do it say flash at me? For some reason, cop cars don't get signs. Easy, brother. No cop drives this bad. Shit, I do. Okay, this is now. This is where you guys want to listen to me at. This is where you guys want to listen. Don't listen to that thing. It's going to steer you wrong. Park your car exactly right here because you're going to need to get out. Remember, in the smile at the other cops. Hey there, officer. Nice badge. Nice badge. Real smooth, Lance. Now, this part, I hope they fixed it. Okay, timers are set. Five seconds and ticking. Five seconds! We got to get the hell out of here! Let's go. Let's go, Lance. Lance, let's go. Now look here. I'm gonna show you guys how to do it. I'm gonna show you guys the importance of the top ride. Get that one. So now you got four stars. Therefore, now it's not as hard. Make sure whatever you do, avoid the spike strips. Avoid the spike strips, okay? Hell, driving the grass for a while. That's definitely gonna help. Fine, stop! But definitely avoid the spike strip, okay? The 
miss a jet damage, you gotta make it back to the bench. You gotta lose the heat. But however, we're gonna lose the heat. Gee, chill the fuck out. I went past my point. Bro! This is not what the fuck I wanted to happen. Get that one. Bro, this cop is so annoying. Come on, what the fuck? Hey, you just glitch up. What the hell? You nearly killed me! Shut up. Second cop arrived right there. Come on, let's make this switch real quick. Come on, Lance. Lance, come on. Take the fucking mind. All right, so far so good. Gee, can you chill the fuck out? That shit irritates me. But this is brand new like a cycle, bro. That shit irritates as hell. Anyways, the third, the second, the other cop right from there, but at this point, I'm just ready to get the bitch over. Not necessarily hard, but this is definitely an annoying bitch. A annoying bitch. So far, so good, and we made it. It's safe to say we made it. Let's go, Lance. All right, that's it. Resetia state completed. Protection ring is complete. Dude, that mission went bonkers. Okay, anyways, that's that. So now when we come back, we're actually going to... Actually, I don't know where... I, I don't know specifically what we're going to start off on. But I'm going to figure it out for sure. Um, But yeah, other than that, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you guys for watching. And in the next video, we're actually going to, like I said, we're going to do Cortez and the assassination mission. And from there, we're just going to do where, go take us, just do it wherever the game takes us. But be, other than, thank you all for joining me so much. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Like, subscribe to the channel. It's, it's going to really help the channel grow. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. You guys stay safe out there and take care.